Now I will show you how to properly transfer a patient using a slide board. This transfer can be used if the patient is not strong enough to stand, requires the use of a slide board due to paralysis, or is non-weight bearing due to a recent surgery or injury. Ask the patient how he or she usually transfers with the slide board. They will hopefully be able to tell you what works best for them. For your safety and the safety of the patient, always use a gait belt. The belt should be placed low around the patient's stomach at about the height of the belly button. Be careful to watch or ask the patient about any recent abdominal surgeries or colostomy bags. In those cases, you may have to place the belt higher or lower to avoid incisions or devices. Make sure the brakes of the wheelchair are locked and the leg rests have been swung out of the way or removed to avoid any possible skin tears or tripping hazards. Also remove the armrest from the wheelchair. Make sure the chair is at about a 45 degree angle to whatever surface you are transferring to. Have the patient lean to the side away from the table you are transferring to, instructing the patient to lift the leg closest to the table. Slide the sliding board underneath the leg, ensuring that it is firmly placed underneath the patient. Have the patient redistribute their weight so that one leg is on the sliding board and one is on the chair. Explain to the patient exactly what you plan to do and what you need from them. It is important that you instruct the patient not to place their fingers underneath the sliding board as this would cause them to pinch their fingers. Stand in front of the patient with a hand on either side of the gait belt. Squat to use your legs to help the patient slide across the board. Do not twist your back. On the count of three, help slide the patient slightly onto the board. At the next count of three, slide again until the patient is safely on the table. Have the patient lean again to remove the board from underneath their bottom. Make sure the patient is safely on the table and remove the gate belt. 